What was that noise? Uh, whatever. What is up, my squirtle lights? It is I, your king. Welcome you back to more Let's Play Horizon Zero Dawn. In the last episode, we finished up the mission involving the Banook, and we had to fight a rock breaker, and I'm still kind of salty about that. But anyways, in this episode, we are going to be continuing on the main quest. We don't really have many other side quests left. We have that Hunter's Lodge one, which I will get to at some point, but I'm not really too eager to do that because if it involves hunting of any kind in this game, usually it's not really that fun of a quest. But uh, like I said, we'll get to it. Um, we're going to get on to the main quest now, which involves us going to the Grave Horde. Um, however, we do have to walk through Prime Stormbird territory to do so, which I am not all that enthused about doing. I don't know if we're going to actually run into one, though. We might. We'll see. If I have to fight it, I will. They're not as... They're not so bad. I'd rather fight one of those than a rock breaker any day of the week, honestly. And I also think they're a lot more cool. So, let's grab all this medicine stuff, because I definitely need to fill up on that, because especially when we're about to get into main quest, those have got to be bandits. Still sniffing yes, they are. And I got them both. All right, let's get over there. Maybe they'll have some potions I can grab because I kind of use all of mine in the fight against the freaking rock breaker. Like, ugh, that was so annoying. Jeez, there's actually tons of. Why are there so many people around here? This is really weird. Anyway, um, let's go up this way. All right, get up towards the top. I see glint hawks, but I do not see a storm bird, which is interesting. Also, check this place out. Wow. Also, oh hey, Metal Flower. Awesome. Look at this place. That's like the legs of one giant corruptor. Isn't that something? That's where we're headed, and I don't want to know what that was down there, but we're going to not worry about it. And I... Oh, there's apparently a bunch of things down here that are all looking for me. More humans. That's what... Yeah, I'm going to try to ignore those guys. And uh, probably going to have to deal with these Glint Hawks, which is I'm fine with. I, I'd rather fight Glint Hawks than these people any day, because they're a much better reward. Okay, let's go. Screw it. Let's do this thing. There we go. Fall to the ground. I can't get to you, because of course you decided to fall in a higher spot again. Don't do it. Please burn, please burn. You need to land on land, thank you. And I, apparently I wasn't able to get that critical hit in time. Almost got you. Almost. Burn. Burn. That'll kill you. Alright, good. Where's one? Taking damage, but that is okay. I am fine with that. That one tried to dive bomb me. There we go. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Ow! No, 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 no. Fall, please. I know you want to. Please let me crit. It won't let me crit. That's fine. We killed it. All right. There we go. Let's heal. I'm, I can't see because of the foliage for some reason. Woo! Pardon me, sir. You need to drop... Oh, my... Oh, this camera! Please. There we go. No, no, no. No, no, no. Ugh. Glint hot. A glint hot got in my way. Couldn't do it. Okay, we got a few hits in there. Let him burn to death. There we go. Okay, he's gonna die. Let's kill this one. Just kind of spam arrows at them. It's not gonna do any additional damage if I charge it up anyway. Or if it does, it doesn't do enough. Why are these not connecting? Like, seriously, none of them are connecting. Okay, this is fine. This is fine. Can I at least get up and get some smashes in on him? No. Not in time. Right, that's fine. We're all right. Where are you? Please fall to the ground, you jerk. How far did I just fall? Because I don't like that. You! Get down! Son of a gun. What the? Aloy, please climb up this terrain. Aloy, please. Aloy, please. Ugh. Please just burn. I don't even care how many fire arrows I'm using. Jeez. I have so much blaze, I couldn't even... I could not honestly care less. Alright. 
Got the experience out of it. I'm fine. Grab all their stuff and let's head on up into the grave horde. Kind of annoys me when I fire all those arrows and they just curve around the enemies. It's like, really? Come on now. Also, I don't know why it's telling me to go that way. Maybe I have to go another way to get up there? Maybe I do. Oh, you know what? I bet I have to take this path. That's fine. Just head on over here. And follow this path up. That is literally just a tank right there. That is just a tank. Just a big old tank. Wow. Something else. And this has probably got some debris that I can sell. Cool. I'll take all that. Look at this thing. Isn't this awesome? Huh. Very cool. Eclipse. I'm not showing any focuses at that location. Shouldn't be anything you can't handle on your own. Carry on. Thanks. On my own, all right. As always, Aloy. I don't know what you expected, though. Bye, dude. There's one. Oh gosh, you got me. Woo! Oh, don't do it! Don't do it, Watcher. Okay, hold on. Okay, can I hit this thing? You know what? Let's do this. There we go. Off with you. And then there's this human at. Let's kill him. Because he was so weak, I might as well. Okay, we got another one right here. Let's just... Perfect. Okay, there we go. That got rid of them. We're, we're alright, we're alright. Grab your stuff. Make sure I'm grabbing all this ancient debris, because that's actually all very useful stuff. And I would definitely like it for the metal shards. This is a corruptor here. Why is there a corruptor here? And why is it dead? I guess is the bigger question. What killed it? Or were they just trying to resurrect it and were never able to? I don't know. There's another tank here. The grave horde. And the shadow of a metal devil. Great. A metal now here's the question, okay? So those metal devils, or the things that were being talked about by uh, Elizabeth Sobeck and Ted Faro. The things that were consuming the earth rapidly. Was that this? Was that these things? This this one gigantic beast? Or was it uh, those, cor those uh, corruptors down there? That's the question. Here we are in the grave horde. Oh boy. A quick way down. Oh my gosh. Okay, we're already getting into interesting things, and there are bad guys in here that I do have to be on the lookout for before I can scan anything. Ah! Bye, dude. Huh? Kill them both. That'll do. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. I need to shoot you in the eye. There we go. And then you, sir, you need to die. They're inside, too. Okay. So we're going to probably be running into humans all over the place in here, but that is okay. Let's grab some stuff. Let's take a listen. Sergeant Ames give or whatever. Say it again, Lieutenant. I got so. Titan is through the defenses. Still on approach. Are you getting this, Silence? Silence? Looks like quite an enduring victory we put our foot in today. Contact in 30 seconds. Hey, think that's enough time for Sobek to finish Zero Dawn? <laughs> <laughs> if this is really it, I gotta say, it's been an honor to serve beside these tanks. <laughs> 
Here it comes. Grease for contact! Whatever that was sure killed him. You getting this? What is it? All these soldiers. They died here. People die all the time. I'll keep going and find something interesting. <sighs> Whatever it was just frickin' cleaned right through them once it finally attacked, that's for sure. Alright, let's head on inside. Do I have to... Hold on, how do I do this? I just I can't just drop down here, can I? Oh, here we go. Nope! Can't do that! Here we go. Alright, figured it out. Uh, I don't know what I was thinking there. Alright, let's see. Take it nice and easy. Let's not get ourselves killed again. And drop. There we go. Alright, here we go. Oh! Now this certainly is something. Okay, I can go up there, but I kind of want to look around here real quick. Well, actually, I don't know if I want to go in the water. Is there anything of note at all? Doesn't honestly look like it. All right, well, in that case, let's just pull ourselves up and keep going. So obviously, as with the last place, we're going to be getting a lot of lore information here. So I'm not going to be doing a whole lot of talking in this episode. Because there's just so many interesting things going on. Log. First battle of the Eastern Seaboard Wall. A long run on to it. Heart, I guess. This was before Kalmar, and projections were a lot worse for the East. For three weeks, we kept getting scrambled out to some coastal burb to train Minutemen. It was always raining on account of Europe already being torched. Block after block of prefab barracks. They were still printing barracks right up until the hour the main force hit. The Minutemen? We ran combat drills with them in the streets where they'd lived trying to pretend they might live to die somewhere else if they paid attention. Nothing worse than the ones who actually bought into it. Hopeful, pestering us with questions about Zero Dawn, like we know something they don't. I swear, the more we do this, the more like the bots we are. Except they learn from every fight. And us? I'm not so sure. Silence, you getting this? What is it? Oh, Wait, okay, you don't need to say that again, Aloy. They died here. People die all the time. Log. I'll keep going and find Third something battle of California Marine. The swarm came in from the Pacific, and I don't know oh, if it was the local nice. Minutemen or the crazy 15th, but they'd set the garbage patch alight. Man, the sea was on fire. That stuff was... <sighs> the first wave of bots came in covered in burning sludge. They bought us an hour or two of slaughtering them on the beaches before the swarm recalculated. We pulled them inland, back to the Kalmar sprawl. Dropped buildings on them, EMP'd the grid. Standard operating procedure. <sighs> the last time I was in California, I was... five, six? The light was like that vintage social net filter that was everywhere in the 40s. Recalls, I've been instructed to remind you of Article 115 of Base Policy regarding unauthorized use of processor cycles. 
specifically 115C. Any holographic simulation not directly related to operational training or efficiency. Consider yourself reminded and enjoy your gaming. Was, was that supposed to be to me or? <laughs> Thanks for the mails, you. Time goes fast on active duty. Four months with the wreck and recalls. I don't know, 20 drops. In and out of the West Coast, fighting with these civilian enlistees, scrappy guys and gals. Their training is basically, here's a DEW, when you see a bot, hit it. <laughs> but somehow it's all coming together. Between us and the 6th MRB, we took down a horse at Lithium Beach. Pulled out before its buddies arrived, but to see a big one go down. I hope you made the news, honey. Showed everyone we're gonna have a shot at turning this around. We just need to give Project Zero Dawn the time it needs. Then everything will be the way it used to be. So the big ones are called Horuses. Now that's something interesting. I know it's been days, honey. I'm so sorry. Deployments are uh, getting real long and tougher every time. The swarms the getting better at predicting us. Little. Less of us now, and we have to put in ten times the work the for everyone world. gone. Like a family to. business on hard times, only... This isn't my family. It's not with you. I still try to see you. The life we had, in the eyes of the people out there. I remember when they were glad to see us. When they still had hope. It all seems to be slipping away. I don't even recognize the places we're defending. The only thing I know I'm still fighting for is you. The Zero Dawn to turn this around? Or whatever the hell that is. They didn't even know what it was. There are so many different things here. <sighs> Looking back, I thought 64 was shaping up to be a pretty good year. No more drinking and no more mercenary sec work. Stripling. Uh, stripping offshore wind farms for the OEZ. Just me and a plasma cutter 400 feet above sea level. Then I got the recall alert. Read them up on a turbine and the smell of cooking ozone. They covered every angle. Better pay. Amnesty for any combine wars you'd fought in. Guaranteed citizenship. We should have thought, okay, what's the catch? But what we did think was, I guess we're better than the bots after all. Big talk from Harris about pride and duty. Smart guy. He was right. I'd been proud to be a U.S. soldier. I should have the chance to be one again. And look what I landed in. It's just a bad deal for everybody involved. Like, just there was no way of winning this, and they knew that. Hmm. Just one bed. Maybe the war chief's room. Last night we got talking about D-Day 55. I was a kid then, only a few years out of boot camp. General assembly in a drone hangar. Summer in the sky was bare. The heat was killer. They say U.S. human combat forces are being disbanded. All automated now. Where's last cycle's tech? Out like the old net. A million more on basic in a century recession. Could be you'll help build the robots that took your jobs. Or if you know how to handle a power suit, you could find a place that still uses manual labor. Maybe in the OEZ or China where you're not our problem. Low suicide risk, it's, uh, low suicide risk, it said in my discharge file. Oof. What a dismal future. Okay. Um, but I mean, obviously not unlike anything we see in sci-fi constantly. So uh, I guess we better head on down. Oh, that is a thing that you can grab onto. And I did not know that. Okay then, Aloy. So what else do we got going on around here? There's so much to look at and s honestly not enough time to do it in. We got another one of these doors. Red light. Guess that means no power. There were those doors from back in the day. Oh dear. What do we got going on here? It's a puzzle of sorts? I think this is a puzzle of sorts. Where can I jump across to right here? Jump. There we go. Good job, Aloy. All right, let's see. I haven't seen one of these since I was a little kid. There must be some kind of code. Now obviously. Maybe I should try scanning objects in this Yeah, area. let's do that first. Okay, so let's take a look around. There are all sorts of things. There seems to be, huh, four of these locks down here. Woo! More of them. Which I don't really know if I can mess with them at all. Hey, y'all wanted to know how I remember the geotherm system reboot? Goes like this. 
bird flies north in summer, east in spring, west in fall, and south in winter. Didn't expect Oops. to hear nature poetry from the lips of Mike the GT Tech now, did you? As usual, I defy expectations. Well, let's freaking initiate that. Oh, that's informative. Okay, so it did it. So now, how do we get the rest of these to work? All the same? I wonder if they're all the same. I actually have those backwards. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Wait a minute. I'm forgetting the log. I know south was last. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Nope, I have this backwards. I have this out of order. Hold on. I'm already forgetting the way that the log worked. This one's... No, never mind. I think that one's different. These wires must run to the power source. Okay, clearly... Well, my question is, is what's the... Is it backwards this time? Okay, hold on. I'm going to go play that audio point again. Just a second. Notebook. Data points. Hey, y'all wanted to know how I remember... Okay, hold on a second. Uh, north, east, west, south. Gotcha. It might be backwards this time. North, east, west, south. No? It isn't from right to left this time? It's got to be something different if this isn't it. Nope, it's definitely something different. Alright, let's take a look around some more. Can I go down further? I can- Hey, Lloyd! Why? Okay, apparently Aloy is incredibly slippery here, so I have to be very, very careful with her. So consult GT Tech for that one. What's this one say? Uh, doesn't actually tell... Oh, oh, it actually does tell me. That one just straight up tells me. Down, down, up, up. Okay. Or, is that supposed to be the other way around? Maybe it's supposed to be up, up, down, down. Now that I think about it. Hold on. Am I right? Yep, That's that one's true. correct. Okay, now we just need to go back to the upper level and fix that one. And let's not frickin' fall this time, because apparently Aloy likes to do that very easily in this area. Like, that actually wasn't my fault that time. She just fell. I tried to stop her, but she just fell. So, nothing I could really do about it. And then what does this one say? Data. Oh, and now that one's actually going to tell me, too. Okay, so up, down, left, right. All right, cool. Well, thank you so much for just straight up telling me. Okay, that did it. All right, now I need to get back to... I don't really trust that jump. Oh, I have to make it, don't I? Oh, my gosh. I can't believe she landed that. That felt really like a really bad jump. Woo! Okay, we're good. Everything's fine. Let's keep going. Oh, there's all sorts of fun things in here. That's not good. And this, here we go. Power cell. Make sure you grab that. Well, what do I do with it? Whew. Okay, so we got another one of those. And oh dear. Well, all right then. all right. They're not looking for answers. Ladies and gentlemen, we're going to deal with this in the next episode. Thank you all so very much for watching this episode of Let's Play Horizon Zero Dawn. I hope you all enjoyed it very, very much. And I will see you all in the next one.